In this video, we will write a code in Python to identify image folders on our hard disk. In our program, an image file must have the file extension of .jpg or .png and width and height must be larger than 500 pixels. First, we need to install Pillow, which is a third-party Python module for interacting with image files. To install this package, we need to click on File and then Setting. And under Project, Project Interpreter, then over here, we need to add I already have installed Pillow module, but you can search over here, by tapping PIL. It's a Python image library. You can install this package. And after the install, you just close this window. First, we need to import OS module. Then from PIL, import image module. Now we will use a for loop. And in this for loop, we are going to call OS function walk and give it uh, our C drive, path of our C drive. So we can get folder name, subfolder name, and file names. Folder name, subfolders. and file names list in os dot walk and here you can give the directory in which you want to search for image folders And now we will use a variable image and initialize it with the zero. In this variable, we will count, keep the count of image or increment this variable whenever we find an image file. And we have an, uh, our other variable other files in this we will have count of other files than images and we need another loop for in which we can loop through a file name list and file names when we loop through each file we will check if that file names end with JPEG or PNG. If it's not JPEG or PNG, if you don't have the extension of JPEG or PNG, then we will just increment the variable other files. If not, file name need to convert this in lowercase lower and then we will use functions ends with extension jpeg or 
file name to lower lower function here need the, and should be uppercase lower now here we need to check with PNG file is not an image file then we just increment our variable other file by one and then continue if we have image file then we can use image file then we can use image modules open function to get a image object in a try catch block try image and then we can call image class open method and it requires image file name that we can get by os dot path and then join folder name and our image file name and then we need accept OS error and then we need continue now we can get image width and image height from our image object this image dot size we can have image width and image height so we can check if the image size is the one we are looking for whose width is greater than 500 and also height is greater than 500 so we are going to use if condition if image width is greater than 500 and image height greater than 500 then we will increment our images variable If it's the width and height is less than the one we require, then in else block. We can use other files 
and increment it by one. It can be an image, but we require that it minimum width should be 500 and also height. So it should be more than these. Here we are missing assets, the variable the images. And in the end, we can check if our images are greater than other files in folders, then we can print that folder name. So we're just gonna do if images greater than other files then we can print the name of that folder in which we have more images than other files os dot path dot absolute path or apps path and then give it folder name folder name Over here it is size not sizes so we need to fix this one let's give it a space of this now we just need to run this program now you can see it started listing the directory names which has more images file for more videos please subscribe to our channel thank you